Hi, this is Dr. Scott Gray from Back in Motion Support and Spine Physical Therapy and Pelican Sounds Physical Therapist here on site at the Fitness and Wellness Center. So in this quick video uh, for golfers out there who've got back pain, uh, I want to describe why most golfers do get back pain when golfing. So uh, I'm going to act as if I'm a golfer here. And so the most common thing that we see is back pain either on the backswing or on the follow through. And it really occurs for two different reasons. What we commonly see here at the clinic is uh, tightness of our hip joints. And so when the hips aren't able to rotate, we'll then get more torque and torsion out at our lower back. Okay? Same thing goes with our upper back. Our upper back, which is called our thoracic spine, was made to rotate, especially for golfers. And when it gets stiff and rounded over, it can't rotate it needs to do. So then we get, again, more um, compression and shear at the back. And um, over time, it can compress the joints and you can, you know, take a little bit longer time to warm up. You might have to use ice at the end of the day or even heat at the end of the day for your back um, because it's achy. So uh, case in point here, back in motion, we can fix that and work on that. All you need to do is just um, call our office directly to book an appointment. But in the next video, I'm going to show you a couple of stretches that you can do and apply directly from your house or even on the golf course to swing pain free. All right, so if you've got lower back pain when swinging the golf club, or even when you just walk, these are a couple of nice and easy stretches that you can do to help um, correct and fix your back. So as we said in the previous video, our hips get tight. So I'm here inside the wellness center, and this is called a true stretch. And what I'm gonna do is put one foot up onto the cage, and I'm gonna put my back leg back behind me. From here, I'm just gonna lean into my pushing my pelvis forward. And what I'm gonna try to do is feel a stretch in this front thigh, but also my calf, and what that's gonna do is help loosen up my hip joint. So I'm just gonna do a few here. Okay, so after I've done about 20 each side, I obviously wanna do the other side. From here, we wanna work our way up and um, stretch out and get this part of our back working. And so some of these chest muscles pull us tight and rounded, which limits our motion. So I'm just gonna place my hands here on the cage. I'm gonna go in that straddled position, and I'm just gonna lean into it again but the goal here is really to stretch out my chest muscles. And then again, from here, I'm gonna hold for approximately 60 seconds for up to two minutes. And I would do this daily, especially before I go golf. So there you have it. Those are two simple exercises that you can do to help loosen up your upper back, but also your hips to help your lower back.